Uh, this is boy Trey Songs right here. I just touched down in Dallas. It's going down on poolside. You can't see right now, but it's a bunch of ladies behind the camera. I don't know why black folks don't get in the pool at the pool party. We're going to figure that out very soon. Tell the DJ, turn it up. Bet the DJ, bring it back. Tell them, play that shit again. Tell them that you like that, like that. Oh, Trey, I ain't got but two reasons to be here, man. All the bottles pop a bottle. <laughs> I know it's somebody's birthday. Right now, right now, right now. Right now. I'm here to promo my album, Chapter 5. August 21st is the uh, release date. Last time I was here in Dallas actually was uh, for a show on Valentine's Day. It was amazing, uh, like another aspect of the Anticipation 2 tour. Uh, and right now, the album is 10 days away. Dallas is a big fan base for me. It's a big market. I'm always here showing love, and they always showing me love back, so I had to come, you did. Bitches in the drinks for the bitch came for the bitches in the drinks. Uh -huh. Bitches in the drinks. Right. Bitches in the drinks. It was probably a decision I made at the age of 15. Uh, when I figured out that singing was very important to me, that it was something that I loved so much that I couldn't do something else. Uh, I had recorded my first song, and after listening to it like time and time again, I was like, I could actually hear myself on the radio. I went from something being a dream and a mentality to you know, something that I thought I could really attain. Yeah, my mother was. Uh, my mother was very supportive of me. We have a great relationship even still. Uh, after high school, she gave me a year to, you know, pursue that dream while she still funded it. And uh, actually a day after the year was up, like the day after I got my first offer and that was like a blessing from God. Uh, but yeah, my mom was behind me the whole way. Oh, that's a great question. Uh, I don't think there's, that words really describe the feeling when you get to do what you love and and take care of your family and uh, you know have people love you for doing something that you would do if nobody cared about it. Uh, you know, my mother, my grandmother, my aunts, my little cousins, everybody reaps the benefits of what it is that uh, I, I, I love to do, uh, and I'm excited about that. Every day, every day I do it for my friends. Chapter 5, August 21st, it's going down. I got great features on there. I got uh, T.I., of course, on uh, two reasons. I got Hail Mary with Young Jeezy, Lil Wayne. I got Don't Be Scared, Rick Ross. I got a record called Check Me Out with Puff Daddy and Meek Mill. I got uh, a lot of great records that I think the, that people going to love. You know, uh, Fumble is an amazing record. Uh, Simply Amazing is my international single that's doing very well right now, and I think we'll cross over here. But it's just basically a... a a real R&B album, you know, I ain't chasing a pop success or a pop sound. It's something that I'm just solidified in, in who I am. And this is the album that's the culmination of all of what my music has been. One word I would use to describe the album. Can I put one word in parentheses? The shit. With the parentheses on shit or the, however you want to do it. Cause it's the shit, that's probably why. It's the shit. <laughs> Chapter 5, August 21st, baby. What up, what up? This your boy Trey Sons, and you're on flytimesdaily.com. Slide by TreySons.com on your way up out of here. Or stay here and then go and then come back.